let's get to it. All right, Cameron. This is the story that a lot of y'all want to see, Cameron. I have not checked it yet. Uh, people have been sending this to me relentlessly and saying, <laughs> Scotty's, call Scotty's calling me. Uh, a lot of y'all said, Anton, you got to check this out. Uh, Cameron was apparently invited over to CNN, a live taping of CNN, uh, in order to speak on this whole Diddy situation now. Okay, before we watch this, before we watch this, let me say this, all right? Because this is a roughly, uh, I try to stay around or under two hours for this show. Who in their right minds decided that they wanted to book Cameron of all people of all people who in their right minds over in the producer studio, and I never call for people job, but you absolutely need to be held accountable for whatever it is. Whoever decided that they wanted to book Cameron on CNN is an idiot. You can't control this man. This man has been trolling his entire life. This is so stupid and I haven't even seen the video yet, but we have to watch the video. And I, <laughs> I'm already cringing before I even pay attention to the video. I'm already cringing about what it is that I'm going to see. So if there's something crazy on here, y'all got to let me know what's going on. Check it out. Thanks for being here. First, when you saw that video of... I like this uh, news anchor, too. I like her. I, even though she's on CNN, uh, my first time really paying attention to an experience in her was when she was just grilling a Jasmine Crockett chick and she was saying, hey, why are you stooping so low in order to you know, do all of this stuff? So I think that a lot of these people that are on these networks are just trying to do their job and keep their job. I'm not really sure if they align with the same political views as the network itself or if it's leaning into that network, but I do like this, this news anchor before we get started. Diddy, Cassie uh, in that hotel, did you recognize that Sean Combs. Um, what I want to say, first of all, when I seen the video, um, everything in the video is egregious. I'm against, uh, I don't support uh, all the charges that's alleged against him. I don't support any of that traffic and minors, uh, domestic violence. I'm totally against it. So when I seen the video, yeah, I was kind of upset with it. Uh, no, being that I know him, he's not necessarily a friend, but yeah, I was upset when I seen it. But did, did you recognize as as everything him? I just said? Did you recognize right, that I kind of anger at all? So, okay. All right. We off to a good start. Cam is is being political. He said, listen, whatever it is that I seen in that video, I don't support that. And I know him. And although I'm not necessarily speaking with him on a regular basis, you know, I don't support trafficking. I don't support none of that stuff. And so he's off to a good start. Okay, okay. So I can see that CNN. It's probably like, okay, we're going to make it. We're going to make it through this. Let's, let's continue. From your experiences? I don't know like that. What do you mean? Do I be recognized? Did I recognize them? I've seen them. What do you mean my experiences? I've seen them and I thought, I thought it was disgusting. I didn't do a zoom in to see if it was really him or nothing, but. <laughs> okay, so what y'all basically telling me is that we're not about to get Cam right now. We getting Rico from Paid in Full. We not getting Cam right now. We getting Rico. Let me rewind this. Well, he turned it up on her for no reason. Come on, Cam. He recognized did I recognize so when I seen it. But did, did you recognize as as everything him? I just said? Did you recognize right. that I kind of anger at all? From your experiences? I don't know like that. What do you mean? Do I be recognized? Did I recognize him? I've seen him. What do you mean my experiences? I've seen him and I thought I thought it was disgusting. I didn't do a zoom in to see if it was really him or nothing, but he admitted it was him. So, yeah, it was him. What did you think? Jesus Christ. <laughs> now, from the naked eye, you would look at this and you would say, is he being serious right now? You know what I'm saying? Maybe he didn't understand the question, but he understands the question just fine. He's incredibly intelligent. He understands the question. He's being crazy. He's being ignorant on purpose. And he's literally trolling. I can already see that the news anchor know who she's dealing with. And she's just trying to 
keep her job and keep her cool and keep her perspective and stay on top of things, baby girl, they put you in a very difficult situation, especially being a black woman uh, interviewing this dude. Man, you got your work cut out for you right now. You got your work cut out for you right now, baby. Yes, you do. Think about the apology that he gave in that other video. Ain't me for this, the apology ain't for me to decide for Cassie. What, what, I, what I think about it don't matter. He ain't do nothing to me. Cassie need to, need to ask Cassie if she accept the apology. I told you I feel, I said what I said. I wanna play a conversation that you had on your podcast back in September with Mace. Mm -hmm. Listen. Yeah. When you had your mm, record that's... deal, why did you take me to Biggie Smalls and not um, Bad Boy? Man, it's almost gonna bring me to tears to say this. I just, being that I saw you as as such a good friend, I wanted to put you with somebody I knew with. Thank you, man. I really appreciate that. A lot of people ask me that on Instagram, yeah, I knew man. With Don't have me just out here crying and shit, it. man. I don't instantly wanna get emotional knew, in here, man. Instantly, I knew Biggie would. Did they know that this segment that he was going to be cursing and stuff like that? What is going on with CNN? Who is the producers out there? Y'all must got a young intern straight out of college that's not familiar with the ways in which y'all are supposed to be operating. Are you literally, seriously, did they literally just play this and it's on a live to where they're playing him cursing and stuff like that from his show? And they're trying to give him some, 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 uh, some play by playing a show on CNN. Man, this is crazy. Would do right by you. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? I mean, is there, um, is there something known in the industry about how Diddy treated his artists? Why is he shaking? So I'm going to get some cheeks after this horsepower joint. Um, is there something known in the industry about how Diddy treated his artists? So I'm going to get some cheeks after this horsepower joint. Um. <laughs> Dog, is so much wrong with this conversation. It is so much wrong with what it is that we viewing right now. So wait, 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 wait. So he decided to use the platform to troll, promote some horsepower thing, and he's shaking like a stripper. Why is Cam shaking? He was nervous. He got to be nervous. In the Look at his hands. About how did he treated? his artists why is he shaking so i'm going to get some cheeks after this horsepower joint um jesus christ i'm just going off what mace said mace took me to biggie i don't really know puff is like mace why no is he puff. shaking like that so i appreciate what mace said and of course uh that's my brother so if he she looked like she about to burn through the screen with her eyes if she had lasers in her eyes, she would burn him up literally with her eyes. She would burn his whole face off. She looked pissed. If y'all have never seen a black woman that was mad, if you've never seen a black woman that was pissed, this is it. If you have never ran into a black woman that that felt a certain type of way about certain things that you were saying and stuff like that, this is absolutely one of those situations where she is mad. Felt Look at her way, face. And he felt that way. I can't really tell you how Puff moves or anything like that. Mace may know better than me because he was signed to Puff. I wasn't. But my show does come on at 8 a.m. Eastern on YouTube. It's called It Is What It Is. Y'all make sure y'all check it out. I mean, I might get some more information out of Mace from there, but for me to tell you, how Puff acting and all that? I don't know. I never was signed to him. Yeah. What about the industry in general? I mean, so many people have pointed out that Diddy couldn't get away with this stuff. 
if there weren't a lot of people protecting him. I know her producers is in her ear like, answer, just ask one more question, baby. Ask one more question. That's the case. Who the talent agent for this joint? Like, you think I'll be sitting around watching what Diddy do and all this? I didn't know this was a Diddy joint that all invited me to. Yo, who, yo, who booked me for this joint? All I'm right. wilding. I don't be Cameron. sitting around watching Diddy. Jesus Christ. This got so bad. This got so bad. Oh, my God. If this was actually launched, like, if this was live, Sitting around watching with him. Do you think that's the case? Who the talent agent for this joint? Like, you think I'll be sitting around watching what Diddy do and all this? I didn't know this was a Diddy joint that all invited me to. Yo, who, yo, who booked me for this joint? Jesus, I'm right. wild and I'll be Cameron. sitting around watching Diddy and all that. Yeah, thanks. Man, come on, man. That's thanks for crazy, joining man. us. Thank you for your time tonight. Yeah, yeah, yo, thank, yo, thank you for having me. You enjoy. Jesus Christ. That is the biggest. <laughs> I don't know if that was a good thing or a bad thing. I don't know if it was a good thing or a bad thing. I, I think he know exactly what he was getting on there for. And he leveraged the platform in order to troll. And I don't know if this benefits him or hurt him. I guess it actually benefits him because it's not like <laughs> it's not like it can get any worse than it already is. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. I mean, is there... Um, Look at his hand is, shaking. Why is his hand shaking? Is there something known in the industry about how Diddy treated his artists? So I'm going to get some cheeks after this horsepower joint. That was very bad. That I mean, dog, dog. Dog, I'm honestly at a loss for words. I've never, ever genuinely been at a loss for words for something like this. Oh, man, that's not a good look. I'm, I'm not a fan of what just happened. Um, I know that Harlem dudes obviously is much, much different. I've never understood the, the mindset behind a lot of these Harlem dudes, but we'll talk about it on After Hours tonight. I'm curious as to what everybody else's perspective is about that. Uh <laughs>